Um, he's standing for 15,000. He's the son of Lana. Um, we are bringing him up from Australia because his first crop are two year olds there right now, and they've done amazing. He's had five starters, um, which includes three winners and a stakes winner. Um, so he really emerged as kind of their leading first year sire there this year, and as a result, he was very popular in the breeding shed. He stood for 27.5 down there. Um, and booked full at, I think he bred over 160 mares. Um, one of those deals where they probably never intended for him to breed 160, but he was so popular they kept at it. Um, and now we're really excited to be able to share that last night and the last few days have had their first few um, select yearling sessions at Magic Millions. And his yearlings have been one of the hottest commodities on the sales grounds. Um, Gay Waterhouse has brought, bought two already. Um, she's one of Australia's leading trainers, and she's just been kind of gushing over him in the press down there, which is always helpful with the um, stallion seasons. And again, he's standing for 15000 up here, so you're getting him at half the price that you're getting him in Australia. Um, he was an undefeated two-year-old and a group one winning sprinting three-year-old. He's a total outcross pedigree, um, and he raised medication free as he was progeny. So, He's, uh, he's kind of a poor man's long row here, and long row has been really popular with breed to race, um, people who are trying to instill that soundness, that paucity, and that speed into their American 